How you doing? Welcome back to my channel. So, let's see. July something, 12th or something like that. Well, last couple of videos, last three or something videos, been about Rick's bike and his new Road King, his new 07 Road King. So, now, um, I heard it said, I'm going to explain why I'm saying this. I heard it said a while ago, a long time ago, patience is something you can't be in a hurry to have. So, son of a bitch, if I'm not being tested, no one is. So, a year ago, yeah, a year ago, I had the tranny done. Primary, whole package, clutch, everything done. I didn't do tranny, but it only about 25, 30,000 miles. And mine had well over 100, 120,000 miles. So, did the tranny, did everything, and then um, just about two months ago, end of April or something, two, three months ago, had a leak, and the uh, the transmission seal had let go. Okay, so before that was the forks had a leak, got that fixed. So I am I'm I'm cursed when it comes to anything fluid. You know, liquid, fluid. I'm not, you know, I can do electrical. I can do a lot of stuff. Plumbing is not one of my fortes. Plumbing is one of those things that, right, it's faster. So, anyways, so now it's happening again. Yeah, I'm just going to open the door, so, you know, put some light in here. So... Oh, <laughs> sounds about right. Yes, I'm telling you, I had the bike plugged in, you know, so I always plug it in to the um, battery tender. And I forgot to turn it on. Thank God it isn't winter. So anyways, oh. <sighs> oh. See that? That's tranny fluid again. Now, the last three days, I have been adding tranny fluid to it. Not, I'm not sorry, not adding. I, oh, God damn. I, I added tranny fluid to it. Top it up because I've been losing a little bit here and a little bit there. <clears throat> so, really. Anyways. It's going back to Windsor Chopper. I mean, they're going to do all right by, you know, I mean, you know, if anybody can figure out what the hell's going on, Pat can, you know, the, the main wrench there. So, but damn. So, in the meantime, until then, I just monitor it. I mean, unless it's gone, unless it's emptied out, um, I just, um, I keep an eye on it. Uh, it's couple of 300 miles last week and it ended up dropping a little bit so the seal's not really really bad but it don't get better so for three days in a row kind of pissed out a bit you know to the point where I probably lost a good two three ounces so I think it's kind of leveled off a bit right now but I didn't do any real hard riding um was it yesterday the day before yeah so yeah yesterday I just took a ride down there and back so but I'm monitoring it. Sunday, a nice little ride. And I got home. It seemed okay. And then yesterday morning, yeah. So, if I can figure out how to add pictures um, to the uh, to the video, I will. You know, it must be a way. So, so, anyways, at the end of the month, Windsor Chopper is shutting down the service department and just selling parts and that. So, I am going to be going to YouTube school a whole lot more because, like I said, there's a lot of things I can do still, but this is just out of my ballpark range there. So, however, I do have the patience, you know, because you can't, you know, you just you just can't let it get to you, you know. Every now and then I start thinking this bike, my my sweetest dream, flirting with becoming my worst nightmare. Every year I've had it through. This will be my fourth summer. So I bought this in June 2019. 
So I had all of the summer of 1920. So it goes in for a month uh, in, in the summer of 19. Then in 20, it goes in for two or three different things. Then last year, I thought, I'm going to get ahead of everything. Everything. I just had this list. I showed you on one of my other videos there. I got everything done, even trying to circumvent anything bad. <coughs> I didn't, I didn't win, so, I know the tranny, see, I know how many miles is on the tranny now, I know how many miles is on those clutch plates, I know everything I need to know, what I don't know is why the son of a bitch is leaking for the third son of a bitch in time, third time, so, something ain't right, so, and we replaced so much on the bike, it's, oh, son of a bitch, except for the mileage, you wouldn't know, except for now it's leaking again, so, it goes in Monday. So it's dropping it off. Winter chopper Monday. Wife and I are taking off for three days, getting away, you know, getting a nice room to comfort in out in Godrich, and then just relaxing and crap like that, and then come back and deal with it again. So, and I'll just have to start, uh, you know, brushing up on my skills a little more, you know, more YouTube school, because I got to. I got to keep up on this, otherwise I have to get rid of it. So I'm not quite there yet, you know. Um, I don't know how many years I got left to ride, but I know I got this year. So day at a time kind of shit. Anyways, was it worth it? I just <laughs> had that video I did. Oh, shit. A couple, three months back, is it worth buying a high mileage bike? This is one of those times now when I have to remember... You know, how great it is going down the road and just putting it on cruise, letting the tunes play, drinking my coffee, trying not to fall asleep. It's just so relaxing and soothing for me. <coughs> Been that way for me since I was about six years old learning to ride a bicycle. Two wheels and me have always been synonymous. So, now... Doing it again. And I figured you do it so you don't have to anymore. Simple as that. So I'm not totally abandoned. I do have a buddy of mine who's been pulling wrenches for 40 plus years. So probably closer to 50. You know, he didn't have a rattle when he was a kid in the playpen. They gave him a wrench. <laughs> so. Bam, 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 you know, so, anyways, if anybody can help me, if I get into a little bit over my head, he can, so, hey, Mikey, if you ever watching this, <laughs> buddies, right, <laughs> so, anyways, I don't know, he needs me, though, for anything computer-wise, you know, I've been doing that for over 30 years, I can build them blindfolded, so, yeah, <clears throat> anyways, um, not going to be posting much. I might go for a scoot later on this afternoon. Like I said, the oil spill not that bad, but I am not going to try and go far. So we did, um, London and back last week. So it was about 110 miles one way. It was just a nice little ride. Go to Harley Davidson dealer in, in London, Rockies. And then, um, hey, back. That was it. And the next morning, yeah, it had, it had leaked some more. So I checked it. It was down a bit. So it's not to the point where, oh, I can't make it down the road. But it ain't, once it begins to leak, it doesn't stop. It just gets worse and worse. So I might be able to get a couple more rides in before the weekend. And then we'll see. But <coughs> um, come Monday, it's going in. And pray that's the last time for anything that leaks. Son of a bitch. So, and I'm myself to do. So, just wanted to give you guys a little hello to, and thanks for coming by, by the way. And um, if you like what you see, or if you don't like, thumbs up, down. I get it. Uh, appreciate um, you stopping by. I'm shooting for 100 subscribers. When I started saying this about three or four months ago, I was at 62. Now I'm at 95. Gay, giddy up. So if I can get there, great, you know. People I watch, like I've said, 50, 60,000, 100,000 subscribers. So, I don't know. It's just, uh, 
like I said before, most of it is just to see where um, I've been. Like, I had to remember, when did I do the tranny? So I checked my YouTube videos, and it was about a year ago. So not a long video on that, just, you know, being at Windsor Chopper and all that stuff. So, but, yeah, I got much else to say right now. We're looking at um, a little bit of a ride later on this afternoon, some nice weather. So if I can't go far, I can go around the circles. I think I'm getting paid by the lap, you know. So, anyways, thanks for stopping by. And like I said, hit the subscribe button if you like. If not, that's okay too. In the meantime, see you in the funny papers.